So I have several YouTube videos I've been wanting to film, like a whole health update and um, a part two to my mindset video, and I just have not had the time at all. Um, so I thought today I would just do a quick like day in the life video, um, just to get something up. It should be short and fun, <laughs> just so you guys have something um, until I have time to film those other videos. But on that note, um, I am about two years ago, I posted my whole Lyme story and I wanna kinda do, it's obviously been two years, I wanna do kind of an updated Lyme health journey story. So if there are any specific questions you want me to answer in that video and things you wanna know, leave them in the comments comments so I make sure that I do address those um, in the update and um, I am going to do probably a whole video on bee venom therapy because I get questions about that all the time so if you have specific questions about that too you can leave them below but that'll probably be also another separate video um so hopefully sometime in March I'll get some time to sit down and do those I've just been really busy with work and treatment um with IVIG and just the podcast and life so I haven't had as much time to film um, and edit and all of that mostly film because it takes time um, so let's get today started I'm gonna work out this morning so I'm just having some mashed white sweet potato with a little coconut oil and salt as my pre-workout I've got some raspberry leaf tea here because this is good for cramps <laughs> um, and then while I eat that, I'm going to get a little work done um, while I let that digest about 30, 45 minutes before I work out. Um, I'm just gonna get some work done. I have some client plans to finish up and send out and some Instagram inquiries to respond to. So that's my morning so far. jumped in my sauna for like 30 minutes ish and then took a shower um, and now I'm gonna make lunch so I'm gonna show you what I'm having I'm having a salad and I have some leftover roasted veggies that I'm heating up so I'm just gonna show you how I make the dressing while those heat up so I do like a creamy maple mustard dressing so I use full fat coconut milk it's not gonna focus is it okay come on Anyways, full fat coconut milk. I use some Dijon mustard. I like the Annie's. It's organic and has um, like no weird ingredients in it. And then just some pure organic maple syrup. I don't know why this will not focus. Okay, so I literally don't measure anything. I just kind of do maybe like a tablespoon of coconut milk um, with a squirt of mustard. I don't do a lot. I just don't love mustard. I just like a little bit for the taste. And again, same thing with the maple syrup. Kind of just a um, little bit of maple syrup. <laughs> um, you can see all that in there. And then I just mix it up really well. And like add a little bit of something. If it needs it, it needs like a tiny bit of mustard. Like a tiny bit. Okay, there we go. <laughs> um... Yeah, and that's the dressing I use. So it's really simple and easy. It's really good, creamy. Really like it. Um, you could use honey if you wanted like a honey mustard. All right, so I've just got greens and I chopped up some cucumber that's in here. I don't know why this will not focus. Where I need, there we go. Cucumber. And then earlier this week, I roasted um, a bunch of rutabaga and 
um, like di I think purple radish. And so I'm just gonna add, and so I'm just gonna add some of that on top of my salad. I really just love roasted vegetable salads because um, it gets my veggies in and the roasted veggies are warm in the winter and really filling. <laughs> um, so we'll do that and we'll add the dressing on top. All right, so I've got a big old salad and then I've got just some turkey, um, some sliced turkey rolled up, and that's what's gonna be for lunch. Yum. I made blueberry muffins last night, so I just ate one of these um, post-lunch as my little dessert. <laughs> um, but I know everyone's gonna ask for the recipe. I am still perfecting this recipe. When it is good to go, it will be posted on my Instagram, so make sure you're following me there if you'd like it, or on my Facebook page, um, or my blog. <laughs> Um, but I'm about to jump on a call with a client. Um, we have a follow-up call and then I'm gonna take a little nap. I just heated up some leftovers for dinner. So yesterday I just threw all of this in the crock pot that, or the instant pot. This is carrots and um, parsnips and then some green beans and I put some chicken breast on top of all that, pressure cooked it, and when it was done, I took the chicken out and shredded it. And then the green sauce is a mix of cilantro, greens, olive oil and salt that I just blended together and drizzled it on the chicken. Uh, everything else is seasoned with a little olive oil and salt. So really simple, but nourishing and nutrient dense dinner. So I'm gonna eat that. And then um, tonight I'm just gonna work. I It's Friday, but it's fucking snowing and cold. <laughs> and um, I'm going to hang out with some friends tomorrow. So tonight I'm just gonna get some work done. I've got some client plans to work on. I've gotta get some um, social media posts together for my business, um, for the Influence Health. So if you haven't checked that out, definitely check it out. Um, you can go to the influencehealth.com or my Instagram is Influence Health. Um, I will have all of that linked below, but I'm just going to do some work for my business tonight. Um, and that'll be my evening. So I'll definitely have dessert later and I'll show you that. Okay, so dessert always tends to be like this little mishmashy snack bowl of stuff, but I've got some blue, some of those blueberry muffins I made. These are just so good, I can't stop eating them. And then I have some fruit over here, some frozen berries, um, a, a little bit of cut up pear that I have left over. And then, you all should know this by now, I live off of coconut milk, so I'm just gonna put some of the full fat coconut milk on top. I didn't have time. I didn't feel like whipping it today and making it all fluffy, so I'm just, you know. I mean, it's thick and creamy enough anyways, so just put that on top. And then I like to add a little crunch, so tonight I'm putting on some hemp seeds. Sprinkle that right on top of everything. Yeah, that's gonna be dessert. Um, I'm just gonna go do my usual routine of watching friends, eating dessert, and then I'll do my yoga, um, read for a little bit and go to sleep. I just got this book today, so I'm probably gonna start reading it. Um, I am working on another one, but I've been dying to read this, so I think I'm just gonna jump into this tonight. So that's probably gonna end this video because I just wanna snack and go to sleep and I'm tired of <laughs> recording. Um, so if you enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it seeing these kind of like day in the life what I eat videos, something a little different than all the um, more serious <laughs> educational videos. Um, don't forget to hit subscribe and I'll see you all next time.